Hi everyone, hope you're all well. I thought we'd take a look at mudras. Uh, mudras are hand yoga positions. Uh, so depending on which way you hold your hands, fingers, it stimulates a response. We have numerous nerve endings in our hands and they each work from the left and right hemispheres of the brain. So depending on how you hold your fingers, they create a response which then induces a feeling within us. So we're going to start off with some quite easy ones to do. Uh, when you hold a mudra, you do use both your hands. And don't ever hold the mudra to the point where it's, it's sore. That's, that's not the point. They're just gentle placements of the fingers uh, to help stimulate the essence of that mudra. So the first one we're going to have a look at is called Gyan Mudra. And it's just something, one that you've probably seen a lot of and used and have seen people use when meditating. So the idea is to put your thumb and the pointer finger there together and just rest in your lap. And the Gyan Mudra is all about stimulating a sense of calmness, a grounding calmness. So there we go, just by holding your fingers like that and again, Resting them in your lap, you can do it while you're going to bed, just to help induce that real deep sense of calm. The next one again, moving on uh, to the thumb and the middle finger. I hope you can see it there. This is called the Shuni Mudra, and this helps us with patience, uh, and it also helps us helps to change those negative thoughts um, into positive ones. So holding the Shuni Mudra. And again, you can rest it in your lap. If you happen to be at work, you can put them under the desk so no one can see you doing it. Just when you need that little bit of extra patience. Moving on, the thumb to the ring finger. Uh, this one here is called the Prithvi Mudra. And this helps us with confidence. So again, maybe you're, you're going into a work situation or any situation where you just feel like you need a little bit more confidence. This is the one to hold. Hold this. If you've got pockets, you can put your hands in the pockets again so no one can see what you're doing. You're sitting in the bus or just waiting. You can hold these mudras to help bring about, and for that one, the Prithvi mudra to help bring about confidence. So, just finishing off um, this short segment on mudras, and we'll continue throughout the week. Uh, the thumb to little finger, again, resting in your lap. Don't have it pushing too hard where it becomes sore and this is the Buddha Mudra and this is about where it enhances our intuitive um, communication, our intuitive abilities. Um, so little finger to thumb, Buddha Mudra. So there's four for you to start off with. Gayan Mudra, the calm, the Shuni Mudra to helping us with patience, the Prithvi Mudra for confidence and for intuition communication, intuitive world, we've got this from the Buddha Mudra. So over the weeks, over the day, days of this week, um, we'll explore a bit more with mudras and I look forward to your sharings, uh, having you share what mudras you like to use. Have you got a favourite? Is there one that you use? When do you use it? Share on here. Use this space um, to help communicate and, and get involved with the community which is growing wonderfully. So thank you and have a wonderful day. Enjoy your mudras. Bye.